All right guys, happy Monday. Today we're gonna to start our day off with some front rack lunges. We're gonna do a set of eight at a RP6, so a rate of perceived exertion at a six out of 10. So something that feels like that. Then the next set, we're gonna do seven out of 10 for eight. And then at um, the middle set, or kind of at this set, we're gonna do two sets of eight at something that feels like an eight or 10 out of 10 there. So somewhere within that range. I would side more towards kind of the eight or nine out of 10, but if you do feel like giving yourself a little bit more of a challenge, um, you can definitely kind of push towards that 10 out of 10, maybe for that second set of the two sets of eight. Then you're gonna drop down 80%. So whatever weight you finished off here, your heaviest set, you're gonna drop down 80% and do another set of eight there. So let's say your uh, heaviest was 100 pounds, you're gonna do 80 pounds for that last set there. Goal of this is to work on building strength. So we're gonna be working on in each kind of individual leg at a time. Um, you're gonna feel this in the glutes, the hamstrings, your core is gonna work. So a lot of things are working, but also we're trying to work on a little bit of um, that unilateral exercise to help with imbalances. Um, everyone has a little bit of the imbalances kind of going on. This is a good way to kind of address it and approach strength training a little bit differently um, to help you guys progress in a different way. Sometimes we get stuck doing the same kind of squats all the time. Um, and we develop some bad habits or we develop some imbalances. This is a good way to kind of change the direction a little bit and then revisit strength training with the squats again, deadlifts again, later on in the cycle, which we'll do this after the, uh, the cycle. The workout today is gonna still include some of that kind of unilateral strength as well, but it's a good little challenge of grip and lower body. We have every two minutes for five rounds, we're gonna do five sets of 50 foot farmer's carry. So we're gonna carry um, two or dumbbells, 50 feet. We're gonna go 25 feet out, 25 feet back to make a 50 foot section. Um, once you're done those five sections, you're gonna do max dumbbell step ups, just one dumbbell, as many as you can do in the remaining time of the two minutes. Once that two minutes hits, you're gonna go back to your farmer's carry again. Your score is the number of dumbbell step ups you accumulate across those five rounds. So be smart about how you pace this one. You don't want to just think about that first round and get as many as you can because you got four more rounds after that that are going to continuously happen. So this workout, is a little bit of strategy involved in it. You're going to focus on building that strength in your lower body and your grip because you're going to be hanging on to the dumbbell quite a bit in this workout today. Um, and if anything, try to be moving for those 10 minutes there. It doesn't need to be fast, just keep up a good pace. Overall, hope you guys enjoyed today's workout. We'll see you guys tomorrow for the next one.